Hello, good evening. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to your class. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you, Edgardo? Fine, thank you. And you? I'm fine, too. Great to see you again. Mm -hmm. yeah. Great to see you again. Good. Are you ready for your class? Yanira, hello. Nice to meet you. Hello, Jose. I see that we are only three right now. Mm -hmm. Yes. We are going to wait just for. Hola. Hello. Hi, Janita. Hello. How are you? Hola. How are you? Uh, Janita. Okay. Janita del Carmen. Nice to meet you, Yanira. So, how are you? How are you? Yes. Uh, how yes. was your day today? Was okay. Are you okay? Are you good? Are you okay. fine? <laughs> Great. Great, Yanira. Okay, I see that Martha Isabel is in already. So, welcome, everyone. We're gonna start uh, our last class in this module. And it corresponds also a general review, just as yesterday we did, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, just let me uh, ask the first thing. Do you have any question about the module when you were doing your final exam? Yes. Did, did um, you did you have any question? Any doubt? Yes. Okay. Uh, can you tell me if you had a difficulty? No, no. No? Okay. No, no. Uh, uh, ready. Okay, you did right. it. You mm -hmm. did it. Great. There, you there, finished there. your final exam. Yes. Great. Yanira, did you do your final exam already? Yanira? Yeah. Okay, great. Yes. Great. Mar Marta Isabel, great. did you submit your final exam already? I think she can't listen to us. Maybe not. Oh, yes. There you go. Isabel, did you do your final exam in the platform? Yes. Okay, great, great. Jose Alfredo, welcome to your class. Did, did you good evening. Do, good evening, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Okay, I'm fine too, great. It's nice to see you all guys. Uh, it's very nice to see you. I'm pleased to see you again. Today, I think we are going to start with a little conversation, okay? This will be a conversational thing. I just want you to remember the words that we use to ask questions because that's the most difficult part of this module, I think. But let's see. Just let me share with you this. Okay, there we go. 
We are going to watch this words. Okay, we have this WH words. Do you remember yesterday we said that if you want to ask about a thing, we use what, right? What? Like, give me an example with this word. Give me an example of a question that we usually ask in the first conversation. Mm -hmm. What? What? Mm -hmm. what? What do you do? Great. What do you do? We are asking for a profession, right? Or we are asking for an occupation. Good. So now let's think about a question using how. How? Oh. An example? How are you? Yes, excellent. How are you? It's a very good question and is the first question that we ask, right? For example, we say, oh, hello, how are you? Okay, hello, how are you? Good, so we use this word, how. It's a question word. This word asks for information. This word asks for information. This other word asks for information. This other word asks for information. For example, when I ask who, I am asking about a person, right? What? I am asking about a thing. For example, what's your name, right? Where? We were talking yesterday that we are asking for places. Places. Like the place or the company where I work, right? So, for example... We said yesterday, hello, my name is Carmen, right? And I work at Inglés Corporativo. So mm -hmm. if you ask me, you will say, what's your name? I'm Carmen, right? And then, or my name is Carmen. And then you ask me, what do you do? I am a teacher. Where do you work? I work at... Inglés corporativo. So now let's think about this other word. Today, today we are going to study this WH word. When, when. This word is used when we want to know about the time. Time, correct? Time, yes, time. So we use when. when, when, yes. For example, here I have, this is just for you to remember things that you saw in this module. We say WH questions with what, what do you do, right? Mm -hmm. What do you do? Now, with how, how do you reset the password? Ah, this is a very good question, right? Because usually now that we are online, our online work, then we use passwords. And if you forget what is your password, then you can ask to the tech support department, right? You can ask, how do you reset the password? How do you reset the password, correct? Repeat after me, please. How do you reset the password? How do you How reset do you the, do the you password? Reset? How do you reset the password? How do you reset the password? The password? Correct, good. So now let's think about when. This is the word for today. When. When, when do you when. check your email? When, when do when you check your email? Check your when. email. When do you check your email? 
When do you when use do you your, your email? Your email. So email. now we, we need email. to answer, right? Okay. We need to answer yeah. these questions. When do you check your email? Repeat after me. When do you check do your you... email? When do you when check, do you your, email? check your email? Do you okay, check let's email? do it. Let's do it slowly. When do you check your email? When do you, when do you, you check, check your, your email? Email. 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 Yeah, email. 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 Good. Email. When do you check your email? When do you, when do you, you check email? your email? Okay, now email. we need an answer for this question, right? For example, um, I have and the screen. Let's see. We have, oh, there. Jose Alfredo, when do you check your email? Do you know how to answer this question? Do you know the answer for this question? Mm. When do yes, you check uh, your email? Yes, I, yes. Uh, I am totally, totally. Uh, you check your email? Today, you checked it today. Okay, great, wait. I'm going to show you now. Thank you very much, Jose Alfredo. I'm going to show you now how to answer this question. How to answer when someone asks you when. When means time. They are asking for time, okay? So, just one second, there we go. And we have here, some expressions. For example, we have on weekdays, we have on weekends, on Mondays, during the week, or during the weekend. For example, if I ask when I need a time, an exact time, or a time frame, time frame. For example, in the morning, right? In the morning or at noon, at noon, right? In the afternoon, yes? In the afternoon, in the evening and at night. This is during the day. So let's, let's ask the question again. Let's ask the question again. When do you check your email, Jose Alfredo? I, and, I, uh, I check, only, I check, I check, I check, I check, check your check. email. Uh, uh, one second, one second, Jose Alfredo. Uh, I think it was Yanira, right? Hmm? Yanira said something? Check email. Check, check email. Check, check your email, email means that you go to your computer and open the email and read the emails and reply the emails, correct? You get it? Okay, let's go back. Jose Alfredo, when do you check your email? I am um, check email. I on check. The week. Great. I, I check, check I my check email. My email on the weekend. On weekends. On oh, weekends. Weekend. Okay. Weekend. We don't say on the weekends. Okay. We say on weekends. On weekends. Great. On weekends. On weekends. Okay. Good. Good, Jose Alfredo. Let's go back to the question. When do you check your email, Marta Isabel? I check my email when uh, when have uh, time. Oh, good, good. You don't have time uh, uh, often, but you check your email when you have enough time to do it. Good, good, good. But for example, 
when do you have time to do it? In the morning? At noon? In the afternoon? Mm -hmm. In the evening? Or at night? Mm -hmm. uh, at night. At night. So you have to say, I... I, I check... I check my, my email. email at night. At night. Good, good, good. I check my email, email at, at night. night. Very good, very good. So this is just one question using when, when. What are we asking for? Time, exact time or a time frame. In the morning, could be at um, 6 a.m., 7 a.m., 8 a.m., correct? So, what's next? Ah, we need to know, one second, to ask this. What time is it? Do you know what time is it right now? What time is it, guys? What time is it right now? It's, it's uh, east. Uh, at two o'clock. Okay, this is uh, the the um, examples that I have, but I am asking, what time is now? Now, what time uh -huh. is it? What time is it now? It is uh, six six eight. Uh huh. Sixteen. It's past. It. Uh, six. Six. Seven, no. Six. Uh -huh. seven, eight. Past eight. Great. 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 Uh, let's say it's sixteen past eight. That's what you said, right? Sixteen minutes past eight. Good. Yes. And your module you started after right we use after we can use past and you can use after for example we could say it's 20 minutes after eight right it's mm -hmm. 20 minutes after eight good after after eight. eight. So what time is it now, guys? It's is uh-huh. A it's 20 minutes. Uh-huh. It's 20 past eight, right? Or it's 20 after past eight. Eight. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Correct. Mm -hmm. Eight. Okay. So this is the question that we answer when we ask when. They are asking for a time, correct? So for example, what time do you have lunch, for example? What time is it now? So let's practice saying the time and let's read here one second please and let me put this thing here one moment okay Yanira <laughs> Yanira, I'm going to ask, and you were going to read the answer here, okay? okay? I am going to ask, what time is it? And you read this answer. It's 20 to 10. It's, uh -huh. it's 20 to 10. Great. It's 20 to 10. It's 20 to 10. It's... Great. 20 to 10. Excellent. So I'm going to ask you again, what time is it? And repeat the answer. 
it's it's 20 to 10. 20 to 10. Great. So now by yourself. What time is it, Yanira? It's what time it's it it's 20 to 10. To 10. It, it's 20, 20 to 10. Correct. 20. Correct. So there are two ways to say that, right? There are two ways to say that. Because here we could say another thing. Just let me add this little thing. Okay, here. We could answer it's 9.40. And it's the same thing, okay? It's... Nine. Uh huh. Nine forty. Nine. Uh huh. And we can say just like the other one. Uh huh. It's nine forty. 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 This is a 40. way. Yes, this is a normal way to say it. But a formal way to say it is that we use past and after. Correct. So we could say it's 40. I'm going to leave this. It's 940. Right. Now we could say also it's mm -hmm, 40 minutes after nine. Correct. All right. All right. What time is it? it it's 940. It's 9.40. Correct. Or another answer. What time is it? It's, it's 40, 40 after, after 9. nine. nine. <laughs> yes, but the most common is that we say 20 to 10. Correct. 20 to 10. It's 20 to 10. Correct. So, can you tell me Give me one moment and I'm going to use this thing. Okay, I need to draw this thing. Okay, now, what time is it here? What time is it here? This one. What time is it? Here. It's two. Uh huh. It's two o'clock. Great. Good, guys. So it's two o'clock. Very good. So yeah. now let's practice saying these other. It's two o'clock. Yes, it's two o'clock. But how do we know if it is in the morning or if it is in the afternoon? Uh, we use p.m. and a.m. Remember? Yeah. Mm -hmm. A.m. in the morning. P.m. in the afternoon. In the afternoon. Mm -hmm. Correct. Yeah. Good. So I'm going to show you this just a little here. One second, because I can't find the, oh, here it is. Okay. And now we practice this other. I'm sorry. Oh. Again, 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 again. Here, there we go. I'm sorry. So let's practice saying these times. It's your turn and I want to hear you guys, okay? You are going to say, uh, once again, you are going to say it's, it's I'm sorry, I'm four, sorry. I don't four, know what happened four, here. Okay. here. Great. But I'm trying to erase that thing. One second. There we go. 
Now, we are ready for doing this. Mm -hmm. Let's see, I'm going to, there we go. Okay. Number one, okay. I'm going to ask, what time is it? And you all together answer it and the one that I am pointing. Okay, there we go. What time is it, guys? Four o'clock. Okay, you've got to say it is four o'clock p.m. Okay, we could say p.m. or a.m. Right now, we don't know if it is in the morning or it is in the afternoon. We are just practice the numbers, okay? Practice the time. And in this case, we say it's four o'clock. Four o'clock. It's four o'clock. I'm going to ask again. Great. What time is it? It is four o'clock. It's Okay, that's the most common thing, right? It's six thirty. It's six thirty. That's the most common way. But we have to say something, okay? When we have a thirty, we use half. Okay, half. do you remember half? Yes, half. half. Okay, half. Half. Mm -hmm. half after or past. Okay, after, after six. six. Correct? Mm -hmm. There you go. After it's six. half after six. Correct. So, what time is it? It's half after six. After six. Great. Great. Good. So, let's think about this other one. Okay. Let's think about. Twelve o'clock. It's twelve o'clock. Oh, good one. It's 12 o'clock, great. Now let's think about this one, this one. What time is it? Do you see here? It's, it's 1.45. 1.45, I'm sorry, 1.45 no. is the common way to say it, right? So we are going to use the it's, formal way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's... it's it's 45 after one. Excellent. 45 five, uh -huh. after, 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 after one. 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 Okay, 45 after one. Yes, but usually we don't say that, right? Usually we say un cuarto, right? In Spanish, mm -hmm. we say un cuarto. Un cuarto. A quarter. A yes. Quarter. yes, excellent. So we say a, a quarter. quarter. Quarter of two. Two. A quarter. A quarter. Two. A quarter, quarter to two. Yes. Two, 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 two. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. A quarter to two. Okay. Yes, this is the common way. So we are going to erase this one, correct? So can you answer again? I'm going to ask, what time is it? It's, it's quarter to two. Quarter a to quarter two. to two, great. It's quarter to two. It's quarter to two. Good. It's a quarter to two. two, two. Very good. Very, very good. It's a quarter to two. It's a quarter to two. Right, quarter to two. Yes. Very good. 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 Excellent. So let's 
let's say this one. What time is it? It's 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. Good. It's 12 o'clock. Very good. It's 12 o'clock. Okay. It's 12 o'clock. Okay. We say 12. 12. 12. 12. Always close your mouth at the end of the word. 12. 12. 12. 12. 12. 12. Good. 12. 12. So let's see this other one, the next one. Let's check. What time is it here? Okay. It it's is seven, 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 past it's seven, seven, come on. It's seven, past fifteen, past Good, good. You are doing a great job. Now let's uh, try to give an answer here. Okay, we could say. It a quarter. Uh huh. Quarter uh, two. No, no, no. Uh, it's past, right? Uh, so it is. Hey. A quarter after a. Uh huh. A uh, quarter after a. After. After a. Seven. 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 After seven. 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 Uh, after seven. See, yes. Yes, correct. So, what time is it? It is. After. After. A quarter after seven. Okay. We could say also a quarter past seven. A quarter past seven. A quarter past seven. Yes. Or also, we, yes, correct. So this one, just let me see. A quarter past seven. A quarter. After seven. 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 seven, the other way could be a quarter past seven, and it's okay. A quarter after seven, a quarter, a quarter past, past seven. 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 Correct. So let's say this other one. What time is it here? What time is it? It's. It it is it ten is eight after eight. It is ten. It is ten at night. After eight. Eight at ten at night. It is fifteen after night. Uh huh. It is it ten. Sixteen after night. After Sixteen night. after night. After night. night. No. Okay, you said this one. I, I'm going to write what you said. You said oh, it's. Or, you said fifty. fifty uh huh. After. After, after night. Eight. <laughs> after eight. eight. Uh -huh. eight. Okay, fifty eight. after eight. Yes, but this is not too common. It's more common when we say, eight. When we say it's eight. 10, it's ten, ten two, 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 nine. Nine. two, two, nine. Yes, two nine. it's 10 to nine. So what time is it? It's, it's 10, ten to nine. nine. It's 10 to nine, correct. 8.50, 50, 50 minutes after eight, 50 past eight, or 10 to nine, right? It's 10 to nine. 
Tonight. Tonight. Correct. There you go. Good. Someone is watching TV over there. Okay. okay, just one okay. second, and we are going. Do you have any question about this? No, Do you teacher. have any question? No. Oh, no. Yes. yes, I have. Okay, okay tell me. Se puede decir, no se puede decir antes eh, de las, por ejemplo, 10 minutos para las 9, para las 9, ¿cómo? Yes, Before. this is the one. Yes, of course. Of course, you can say that, and that's the most common way to say it. 10 to 9. Okay? 10 minutes before... Nine, correct? Nine. Ten minutes before nine. Yes, we could use before also. I'm sorry. Okay. We could use also, and let me uh, write it down here for you to check. One moment. Yes, we could uh, say ten before nine. Ten before nine. Yes, 10 before 9 or 10 to 9. Yes. Mm -hmm. Good. Good, good, good. Flies, ¿cómo, okay, ¿cómo, se, ¿cómo se arregla, teacher? Excuse me? ¿Cómo se arregla ahí, flies? ¿Cómo es el action? ¿Qué? Fútbol. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Here, right? 10 before nine or 10 to nine, correct? There you go. These are the answers for this. There you go. So let's see next one. Do you have any other question about this? How to say the time? No. I don't know. Oh. Okay, now I'm going to ask, what time is it now? What time is it now, guys? It's in your it's. watches. Uh-huh. It's. 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 Uh-huh. It's. Do watch. <laughs> okay. In your watch, you see the time. What time is it? What time is it? Ready. It's, it's 20. It's 20. It's 20. It's 20. 20. 20. 20. 20. Correct. It's 20 to 9 right now. It's 20, 20 to, to 9. nine. Yeah. 20 to nine. Yes. Two it's eight. 20 to 9. 9. 20 to nine. nine, correct. Mm -hmm. This is only a review. This is only a review. You started this in the regular classes. So now we are going to continue with this other. Oh, just give me one second and I'm going to get there. <sighs> Trying to. Okay, there we go. So let's see. Um, Karina, are you there, Karina? Yes, I am. What time is it now, Karina? Right now is 20, 20 um, after 30 night. Okay. <laughs> what time is it now? It's 20 minutes. Two, nine. 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 Correct. Nine. Uh, okay. Yes. So what time is it, um, Edgardo? Yes. Mm -hmm. What time is uh, it? It is uh, 22 nine. Great. It's 20 to nine. 20 Good. To nine. Good. What time is it, Diego? It's time is 20 to 9. 
Okay, we answer only it's 20 to 9. That's the answer. It's 20 to 9. Yes, correct. I'm going to ask another question. I'm going to ask, what time do you have dinner? What time do you have dinner? What time? Great, Karina has dinner at seven o'clock. Okay, good, good. Let's see, uh, Jose Martinez. What time do you have dinner? Hello. Hi, hello. What time do you have dinner? I, uh, I have dinner at... I have dinner uh, tomorrow. Mm. <laughs> what time oh. do you have dinner? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Okay. I have I have dinner at nine after the class. Right? I have dinner, I have at, nine. dinner at nine. Good. Nine. I have dinner at, at nine. At nine, nine. nine. nine o'clock or a quarter after nine could be also good. Nine. It's a good time mm. to have dinner. Okay. Let's ask. Jose Alfredo, what time do you have dinner? Uh, I I have I have dinner uh -huh. uh, at uh, fast at um, quarter class. Okay, a quarter after class. Quarter good. After <laughs> class. <laughs> very good. After very good answer. Class. Very good answer. Excellent, excellent. Do you have any question about how to ask about the time? Do you have any question? What do you have to practice to know how to say the time? Numbers. We have to learn the numbers. Numbers. Let's study numbers. What time do you study English? What time do you study English? I, I, study, study, English. I study English at 8 to 9. At 8 o'clock to 9 p.m. Okay. Uh, PM. Uh -huh. PM. Or we could say I have, uh, or I, I'm sorry, I study I, English. I, I, I is good. There you go. Uh, I'm going to say the answer and you just check it up. I study English at eight at night. Correct? At eight oh. at night. That's a very good answer, okay? Because someone can ask at eight in the morning? No, at no. eight. At night. Right? Nine. Mm -hmm. Eight. Or PM. Or PM. Good. Mm -hmm. Or PM. Yeah. It's your choice. You can say PM or you can say at night. Yeah. You can say PM or in the afternoon. Correct? In the afternoon, oh. for example, if it is, if it is at three o'clock, in the afternoon or at 3 p.m. is at 3 in the afternoon, correct? Yes, correct. Questions? No. No, no questions? No question. Okay, now question. let's talk about question. our daily routine. Do you have a daily routine? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you have a daily routine? What do you do yeah, first yeah. thing in the morning, for example, when you wake up? Wait, you're sleeping, right? You're sleeping. Mm -hmm. Then you wake up. Oh, I wake up because oh, I wake up, but I don't get up. So when I get up, ah, oh, then it's a different word. Okay. I wake up. Mm -mm. I wake up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then I get up. Correct. Get up. I wake up and I get up. Correct? So mm -hmm. let's think, and I'm going to show you something. This is a little reading, 
that uh, I want to show you. I'm going to send it through WhatsApp, okay? I'm going to, to send this reading for you to practice later after this module. You can practice about the daily routine and how to say the um, routine from a third person. For example, my cousin, how can I say what does my cousin do every day? Just to remember, okay? Just to remember. So um, I want we to check the exam, okay? I can't find where do I have my thing here. Okay, and let's check the exam. Just let me get there. I had it ready and then I forgot here. There we go. Let's go to the course. You told me that you did it already. But we are going to do it together. Hmm. It's kind of a low this thing. Okay, there we go. Okay, the listening part. Did you have any trouble with this? Any problem? <laughs> Bless you. No. Okay. Did you have any problem with this listening? Do you have any question about this listening? Any comment that you want to say something about this exercise in the exam? No? No problem. Okay, now you are going to give me the answers, okay? You're going to, great, good, because you didn't have any problem. Great. So now we're going to just listen to the audio and you are going to give me the answers. Kind of, oh, I had it there. Okay, here. Okay. Yes, it's kind of slow. Kind of slow, right? There you go. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct answers. One. Your name is interesting, Justine. Are you French? No, I'm not. Are you Italian? No, I'm Canadian. You're from Canada? Yes. My family is from Montreal originally. Two. Where's Mike? Uh, Mike? I don't know him. He's my friend from school. He's a little quiet. Oh, is he okay. serious? Actually, no, he's not. He's very funny. Okay, give me those two answers. Number one, where's Justine from? He's from Canada. Great. Great. What is Mike like? He's funny. He's quite, but very funny. He is a little quiet. Okay. 
he's a little quiet. He's a little fun. But very funny. Yes. But very, very funny. funny. Very funny. Okay, let's check it. And let's continue. Three. Wow, it's really warm today. Yes, it sure is. And it's sunny too. No, it's not. Look, it's raining. Oh, oh well. Okay, what is the answer? What's the weather like? It's raining. Raining. It's raining. It's raining, but it's warm. Okay, let's check it out. And let's continue listening to it. Four. Hey, Sue. How are you? Great, Phil. How about you? I'm okay. Hey, you look great. That's a nice suit. Thanks. It's new. Um, where's Ms. Collins? Uh, she's right over there. She's wearing a blue dress. Oh, I see her. Thanks. Okay. Now, what is the answer? Is Sue wearing a blue dress? Um, no, she's not. Correct. No, no she's not. No, uh -huh. not a she's not. I'm not wearing a suit. Again? No, she's not. No, she's not. She's wearing a suit. She's wearing a suit, okay? Yes. She's yes. wearing a suit. Say it with me. She is wearing a suit. She's wearing a suit. Correct. No, she's not. She's wearing a suit. Correct. So wow. we submit and also I, I think we did it okay. <laughs> yes. Okay. Let's see next. Next part. Next part. Let's read the answer here and we write a question for that answer. The answer says, no, they are not from England, they are from Australia. Let's check the example. What's your name? My name is Tim. That's one example. Another example. Are your parents in Peru? No, they are not in Peru. They are in Canada. Correct. So now, sorry, who's having this problem? Sorry. Okay, now let's write a question here for this answer. No, they are not from England. They are or they are from Australia. Uh huh. Are this is they, are they for England? From England. 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 Uh -huh. Are they from England? And let's remember always write your question mark. One second. I can't see who is the one. Okay, there we go. Everybody has audio? 
Yes. Yes. There we go. Jose Alfredo, please reactivate your activate your audio. And Edgardo, activate your audio too, please. Yanira, please activate your microphone. Open your microphone. Okay. I don't know how to open no. your participants. Mm -hmm. Okay, Jose, you can activate your audio. And Edgardo, please activate your audio. Jose? Or you from? Okay, there you go. And Edgardo, good. So let's continue, let's continue. The problem was the, the, uh, the noises. So are they from England? No, they're not from England. They are from Australia. 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 And let's continue. Aha, uh -huh. the answer says we're from New York. New York. What is a question for this answer? Tell Where me. Are you from? Where, Where are, are you, you from? from? Where? Where are, are you, you from? from? Where are you from? Correct. Where uh -huh. are you from? Where are you from? Okay. Number three, do you know the question that we can use to have that answer? I think she's 22. Oh, 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 are you how? 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 How old is she? How old is she? Correct. How old is she? How old is she? I think she's 22. How old is she? And the answer is, I think she is 22. Is you feel feel Great. So next one. Number four. Number four. The answer says, no, my first language isn't Spanish. It's Portuguese. Is your first language Spanish? Spanish. Is your first language Spanish? Spanish. 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 Who said so? ¿A quién le salió incorrecta? A mí, a Karina. Karina. Okay. We could write another also. No, my first language is in Spanish. It's part of it. But it is correct. Está correcta. Yes, it is. It's your first language, language, Spanish. Spanish. Maybe, maybe, uh, this is just a maybe, that you need to write this as a capital letter. Remember that Spanish, English, Portuguese, and the name of the languages, you have to write them with a capital letter. Maybe is that it's for that, Karina? No, o sea, lo he escrito tal y como nos está indicando, con la letra mayúscula en S. Mm -hmm. no sé. A veces, a veces el, el espacio que uno deja entre eh, una palabra y otra, a mí así me pasó. No en esa, pero en otras. Ok. 
Uh, we are going to write show answer after we finish, okay? And uh, just to see, just to see if my system uh, get it correct. If it, if it get it incorrect, then I'm going to look up why, okay? Then I'm going to see. So let's continue with this number five. And let's, uh, let's wait just for a little, Karina. Yes. yes. Uh, okay. Signo de interrogación in English, we call it question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Mm -hmm. Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Yes. Signo de interrogación. Question mark. Correct. So let's say, let's see the number five. The answer is yes. I'm Japanese. I'm from Tokyo. Are you? Are you Japanese? Are you? Are you Japanese? Are you Japanese? Okay. Uh -huh. Are you Japanese? Japanese. Okay. Are you Japanese? Japanese. Japanese. Are you Japanese? Japanese. Japanese. Yes, let's see the intonation for these questions because the answer is yes or it could be no, right? So the intonation for this is Are you Japanese? 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 Okay, are you Japanese? Japanese. Are you Japanese? Japanese. Are you Japanese? Are you Japanese? Are you Japanese? Are you Japanese? Japanese. Japanese. Yes. Japanese. Yes. I'm yes. Japanese. I'm Japanese. Yes, I'm Japanese. Uh, yes, yes, I'm Japanese. 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 It's not Japanese. It's Japanese. 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 I'm Japanese. from Tokyo. Tokyo. And let's submit. Japanese. Okay, Japanese. There we go. So, do you want we continue with this or do you want uh, we just to say goodbye? What do you want? Do you want to continue? Quieren continuar or quieren decir adios? It's up to you because it's nine already. Ya son las nueve. Entonces podríamos decir that the class is dismissed, but pero aquí es con ustedes. Quieren que lo terminemos? Yes, continue. For me, yes. Great, me, good, yes, good. Bien. Okay, let's continue. Yes. Let's continue. Let's continue. Let's continue. So let's click on next. There we go. Next. Use the correct adjective to complete the sentence. We are going to complete a sentence. Let's read number one. Larry isn't serious. He is heavy. Funny. 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 Okay, yeah, funny. But let's funny. say heavy, funny, or pretty. Funny. 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 Great. Funny. He's funny. Number funny. two. Number two. Jin is really. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Jin is a really good student. She's Smart. very friendly. Really. And she's very smart. 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 Everybody agree? Okay. 
Everybody yes. agree? Yes. Todos de acuerdo? Everybody agree? Yes. Very yes. 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 Great. Yes. So, number three. My teacher isn't short. She is tall. Tall. Heavy. Tall. Yes, I am yes. Tall. Tall. heavy. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Mm. Pretty. Oh, yes, mm. I am pretty. <laughs> pretty. Pretty. Tall. Tall. Okay, oh, my oh, teacher yeah. isn't oh. short. She's tall. tall. Correct, because we are talking about the opposite, right? Short, tall, opposite, right? Good. Number four, my brother is good looking. He is handsome. Handsome? handsome. Yes. Every Everybody agree? Yes. Handsome. Okay, yes, it's handsome because pretty pretty is for women. And here we are talking about a brother, a man, right? So yes, we say handsome. Handsome. Pretty is a woman. Handsome is a man. Very good. And let's submit. Yay. So next part. The next part. I did it already. Uh, let's show the answers. Is this Sue's scarf? No, it's not hers. It's, it's mine. mine. All right, it's mine. Very good. Whose boots are these? Whose boots are these? Maybe, maybe they're Candace, right? Or Candace. Very good. Yes, number three. Number three, can you read it, please? Um, Diego? Are these, these are the, yes, are these Lisa Glove? Yes, they are. Okay, let's try to do it better. It will be, are these, are these, are these, are these, are these Lisa's are these, are these gloves? Gloves. Are these Lisa's gloves? gloves. Are, these are, these gloves? These are, these are these Lisa gloves? Great. Are these Lisa's gloves? Are these Lisa's gloves? Gloves. 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 Uh -huh. Yes, they are yes. here. They are 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 here. Her. 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 Yes, they are her. Hairs. Very yes, good. they are her. 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 Mm -hmm. Great. Whose hat is this? I think it's yours. Our yours. Can you read it, please, Jose? Yes. Number four. I think wash at yours. I think it's yours. Whose hat? Yes. Whose hat? Don't be afraid. Whose hat? Whose hat? Whose hat is this? Whose hat is this? Whose hat is this? Hat. Hat with a hat. 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 Whose hat is this? I think it's yours. I think, I think, I think, I think yours. it's yours. It's yours. yours. I think it's yours. yours. Correct. Good. And number five. Uh, can you read it, please, Edgardo? Are these Peter Peter Peters? Curtis Scott. No, they aren't. They are. They They're They're old. Ours. Ours. Yeah, Ours. very good. Very good, Edgardo. Thank you very much. Can you read the last one, Karina, please? The last 
Number five. Yes. Can I you can. read it? Thank you. Yes. Okay. Are these people in happy home? No, they aren't safe. They are they are ours. Very good. Thank you very much. Do you have any last question about this module? I'm still here. <laughs> okay. No questions? No. no. Okay. So now you remember how to say the time. This is what we learned today. And we did our final exam. Correct? So... It has been nice to meet you. Estoy muy contenta de haber estado con ustedes estos dos días. Así que espero verlos pronto si es que seguimos con ustedes o tendrán otro maestro. Eh, les agradezco mucho su atención y que tengan una excelente noche. You may have a great evening. Thank you. Yes, tell me. Es eh, que hasta I hasta mañana se pueden enviar los documentos. The documents, I think Ajá, yes tomorrow. Escribirse. I I think it is tomorrow. Sí, yo creo que hasta mañana. Mhm. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Teacher, I have a question. Tell me. Eh, ¿será que por ejemplo ahorita eh, en la en la Semana Santa eh ¿Será que podemos entrar como para ir practicando eh, más acerca de esto o ya no se va a poder entrar a la... A la no, a ¿cómo la no? Plataforma? Hasta el 30 tiene, hasta el 30 tiene para entrar a la plataforma. Plataforma. Ah, ok, uh -huh. porque sí. yo sí ya terminé, pero me gustaría como... Repasar. Viendo los videos. Ajá, sí. Correcto. Perfecto. Todavía tiene ahorita cinco días para poder estar practicando y tomando nota de lo que tenga, que le haga falta, ¿verdad? Que usted siente que, que debe practicar más. Uh -huh. Yo les recomiendo Hola. que practiquen el abecedario, la pronunciación de cada letra y les recomiendo que practiquen también los números. Eso les va a ayudar muchísimo para poder soltar un poquito más la conversación. Ok, las letras, la pronunciación de las letras es importante y los números. Ok, ok, thank you. Nice to meet you. You're welcome and thank you for your attention and have a great evening. Ok, Teacher, este, yes, tell una, me. Pregun eh, uh -huh. una preguntita del Consejo Salvadoreño del Café. Los otros compañeros ya están recibiendo clases. Eh, y nosotros todavía estamos aquí terminando. Sí, eh, yo creo que ocho de, ocho de su grupo, ¿verdad? Eh, sí, tuvieron sí. tuvieron un, un cupo ahí. Uh, hay, que, hay que esperar y ver. Eh, hay que esperar y ver el, el... Permítame un momento, me voy a salir uh -huh. de compartir pantalla para que nos veamos todos acá. Ok, uh, hay que esperar y ver... Eh, yo creo que en este caso tiene que comunicarse con eh, la oficina de administración para sí. que ellos le indiquen qué es lo que sucede y qué es lo que les están recomendando a ustedes, porque ahí mm. sí ya es cuestión de, de administración. Uh -huh. sí, sí. Uh -huh. Ellos le van a decir cómo lo llevan o en qué, en qué lo tienen para, para ubicarlo, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Ahorita bien. estamos finalizando módulo 2, ¿verdad? Principiantes 2. Oh. Entonces ya el que viene es principiante es tres. 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 Mm -hmm. Está bien. Eh, ok, mucho gusto. Nice to meet eh, you guys. Y ha sido un gusto también haberla tenido aquí con nosotros. Pues, Thank you very much. Yo creo que todos estamos eh, satisfechos. Okay. Y ojalá esperamos verla. Pronto. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, guys. Oh. Goodbye. Yo ayer falté. Uh, Yanira. Yo, yo, sí, yo ayer no, no recibí la clase, señor. Es que tuve 
eh, falleció un familiar. Ese es el oh. motivo por el cual yo no estuve presente. Oh, lo sí. siento mucho, de veras, no, no, sí. eh, no me enteré de esa situación, pero este puede comunicarlo en mis ya lo comunicó creo en el grupo según me informaron hasta ¿Sí? hace poco pero eh, sí no hay ningún problema eh, no de, no debemos faltar nadie debe faltar verdad ¿Sí? por ningún motivo pero ¿Sí? ese fue un motivo de fuerza mayor entonces usted puede ¿Sí? comunicarse en administración ¿verdad? yo les aconsejo ¿Sí? que cualquier problemita cualquier cosita que les surja directo llamen y pregunten para estar seguros y ah, que no vayamos a perder el beneficio, ¿verdad? Sí, yo sí, solo sí. por eso es la única vez que he faltado y ahí siempre he estado presente. Ok, siempre acuérdense de hacer sus tareas en, el, en la plataforma, ¿verdad? siempre acuérdense de hacerlo lo más pronto y lo mejor posible, porque la idea es aprender, ¿verdad? Ah, sí, sí. verdad que solamente eso es de contestar todas las